Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a momentous occasion in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. As we now have the cast for the long-anticipated introduction of Marvel's first family, the Fantastic Four into the MCU. As the Marvel Cinematic Universe continues to craft its intricate narrative of legendary stories, the inclusion of Marvel's first family stands as a significant milestone in the annals of cinematic history. Join me as we dissect, analyze, and celebrate the ensemble of actors chosen to breathe life into the iconic characters of Reed Richards, Sue Storm, Johnny Storm, and Ben Grimm. Get ready for a roller coaster of emotions, speculations, and superheroic excitement as we delve into the brilliance behind the casting choices and explore the potential dynamics that will undoubtedly redefine the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So, buckle up because the Fantastic Four are about to make a legendary entrance into the MCU. MCU, and she's set to be the main character in this superhero spectacle. Why her? Picture this. Kirby's unparalleled acting prowess and undeniable screen presence make her the perfect fit for Sue Storm. Known for her ability to seamlessly blend strength, grace, and charisma, Kirby embodies the resilience and complexity that defines Sue's character. Vanessa Kirby is primed to bring depth, authenticity, and a whole lot of superhero magic to the MCU. The immensely talented Pedro Pascal has officially been cast as Reed Richards in the MCU, set to lead as the brilliant and stretchable Mr. Fantastic. Brace for a mind-bending performance as Pascal, known for his exceptional acting range, steps into the shoes of the iconic scientist and leader of the Fantastic Four. With his captivating presence and ability to convey intelligence and depth, Pascal is poised to redefine Reed Richards for a new era of superhero storytelling. Joseph Quinn has been cast as Johnny Storm in the MCU, set to blaze onto the screen as the iconic Human Torch. Known for his dynamic performances, Quinn brings a perfect blend of charisma and youthful energy to the role. As Johnny Storm, Quinn is poised to capture the fiery spirit and wit of this beloved Fantastic Four member. Eben Moss Bachrach has been cast as Ben Grimm, bringing the legendary thing to life in the MCU. Known for his remarkable acting prowess, Moss Bachrach is set to embody the strength, resilience, and heart of this beloved Fantastic Four character. As Ben Grimm, he'll navigate the complex duality of a rock-solid exterior and a deeply human interior. Brace yourselves for a powerhouse performance that will redefine the very essence of the thing. The MCU is about to get rock solid with Eben Moss Bachrach in this epic role. Marvel has truly outdone themselves with the casting of the Fantastic Four. Vanessa Kirby's elegance and strength as Sue Storm promise a captivating invisible woman, while Pedro Pascal's charisma is set to ignite the screen as the brilliant Mr. Fantastic, Reed Richards. Joseph Quinn's dynamic energy as Johnny Storm, the Human Torch, adds an exciting spark, and Eben Moss Bachrach's powerful presence is the perfect choice for the thing, Ben Grimm. This ensemble of talent not only aligns with the iconic comic book characters, but also hints at the incredible chemistry and depth we can expect from the MCU's rendition of the Fantastic Four. There are also new rumors swirling around suggesting that Javier Bardem may be stepping into the colossal shoes of Galactus, the devourer of worlds. Imagine the gravitas and intensity he could bring to this cosmic entity. But that's not all. Anya Taylor-Joy is also rumored to be playing Silver Surfer, Herald of Galactus. This would mark a significant change from the original depiction of the Silver Surfer, as up to now, the character has always been portrayed to appear as a male. Fantastic Four may be getting slightly delayed, as filming is not scheduled to start until either quarter three or four of 2024 due to Pedro Pascal's busy schedule. It is very unlikely that the film will hit its current release date of May 2nd, 2025, as this will not leave much time for post-production to be completed. As a result of this Fantastic Four, will likely get pushed back to the end of 2025. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.